You know, we keep hearing about a slew of new projects from Memphis, especially downtown, uh, from new hotels to new apartments and new retail, too. While most projects remain in the pipeline, they are still going to happen. The timelines for actually finishing a surprising number of them still up in the air. Our Zaria Oates is looking into what's causing these delays. Mayor Strickland authorized Memphis 3.0 back in 2019 as a guideline to grow the city. Today it's acting as a baseline of where new developments will have the most impact. The plan identifies uh, over 100 places that uh, are called anchors, uh, which are centers of communities and neighborhoods all across Memphis where we hope to see new growth happen. And one of the anchors is downtown. Several development plans are on Union Avenue in the Pinch District and surrounding St. Jude. However, when these developments will make their way into the future of downtown is unclear for multiple reasons. Certainly with COVID and, and the disruption um, that, that that caused, uh, but now with rising interest rates and what uh, that means for access to capital for for some of these big projects uh, to be able to move forward. Those disruptions impacting two major developments, the walk that's set to be on Union Avenue and the Pinch District, which is expected to have a multi-phase reconstruction to bring life to the district. The walk and investments uh, in the Pinch have uh, the potential to make big impacts on our downtown. There will be activated structures with people living in them. There'll be new businesses, new hotels. All of these things make our downtown vibrant. While these projects are at a brief standstill, both Zena and Young stress that the funds for these projects are coming from the developers, not residents. There is no money uh, that is coming out of city and county coffers. As of now, there's not a set date to expect the completion of the active projects, but Young says the walk has 18 months to begin construction. After that, it'll take about two to three years to finish the project. Downtown Commission is still working with the Pinch Project Development Team. If all goes well, they expect the Pinch to be on a similar timeline as the walk. In Memphis, I'm Zaria Oates.